Hello everyone and welcome to Tipsy where we actually provide you with top predictions based on a lot of criteria. And you may actually wish to know how we actually get these predictions. Of course, we are now using our own best AI intelligent tool that actually analyzes matches based on a lot of criteria. After which we manually make these picks and go further to use third party sites such as SofaScore and Bet Explorer to make sure that we check for the form of the team, the home and away performance of that team, as well as top scorers. And if this actually meets our need, then we actually come to share them with you. We can therefore say these predictions are over 90% accurate and you can actually make your bet picks and analyze and include in your bet slip. Therefore, if you are new to this channel, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button for new post notifications and updates. So this is actually what we have for you today. Today, we have eight matches to share with you. And you can as well check our handpick 2 plus odds from the website link below this video description. Also, as a quick reminder, please make sure to use only a maximum of four or five matches per single sleep so as to boost your winning chances by over 100%. That being said, the first match in our today's list is actually in the Netherlands, Este Divise. It's a match between Heracles Almelo playing versus FC Dortrecht. Here, of course, you will look at the standings. Heracles is the best in the stands. First in its league table, 17 matches has been played, 13 wins, 47 goals scored and 21 conceived as compared to Dortrecht in the 15th position that has played 17 matches. 5 win with 22 goals scored and 27 conceived. And of course, if we screw right down, we are going to see that the performance rate of Heracles is better as compared to Dortrecht. If we now look at the head-to-head -head between these two teams, we are going to see that the most recent game played is not in this year. But based on the performance rate of Heracles, of course, we are actually expecting the win from the home team. Or you can as well go for an over 1.5 goal as the next possibility in this game. Or you can give it a shift a chance or one DNB as the best pick in this match. The next game in our list is actually in the Europe Champions League women. It's a match between Roma playing versus St. Porten. And of course, we have two possibilities or even three possibilities to occur in this match. The first possibility is the home team that has Roma women to win. The second possibility is the fact that an over 1.5 goal is very possible in this game as well as the third possibility is an over 2.5 goals as a possibility. If we scroll down this table, we are going to see that they are actually in position 2 and 3 of their table, while Roma has played 4 matches. They have win 2, 8 goals has been scored and 8 conceived, as compared to St. Porten women that has played 4, 1 wins, 5 goals scored and 9 conceived. Now if we scroll right down and check for the performance rate of Roma, they are really great as compared to St. Porten and of course, if we now look at the head-to-head -head between these two, we are going to see that they have actually recently met and seven goals were recorded. And here, so we are also expecting an over 1.5 goal as one of the best choice here. Second choice being the fact that we are expecting Roma, that's the home team, to take the lead in this game. And also an over 2.5 goal is a big possibility to occur in this game. The next match in our list is actually still in the Europe Champions League women, but this time is between uh, Valasnia Skada playing versus Chelsea, Chelsea, and of course it's still a woman champions championship uh, championship that has Champions League women, and of course if we now look at the standing, Chelsea women is the best here. First in the stands, four matches played with three wins, twelve goals has been scored and one conceived. In other words, Chelsea is very offensive and very defensive, even though they are going away, being on the high offense rate. We are expecting it to take the lead and you can see its opponent has played four no wins with 19 goals conceived they are very conceiving so that because of this chasing women was going to take the upper hand and if we look at the performance rates of Vasnia women they are not as good as chasing women now if we look at the head-to-head -head between these two we are going to see that they have actually met once this year chasing women played home they actually lead with eight goals recorded and of course this time is going away we are still expecting a straight win from Chelsea women, or an over 1.5 goal as next possibility, and even an over 2.5 goal is a possibility to occur in this game. The next match in our list is actually in the Belgium 
that's Challenger Pro League. It's a match between Club Rouge playing versus Lise. And of course, here we are expecting an over 1.5 goal as one of the best choice, as well as an over 2.5. If you look at the standing table, they are almost on equal stands. That's fourth and sixth position. They have equal performance rate. You can see for Lise, they have played 17 matches, 9 wins, 35 goals have been scored, and 36 conceived. As compared to Club Rouge, that has played 17, 7 wins, 33 goals scored, and 27 conceived. If we look at the performance rate of Club Rouge, they are really great, same way as Leeds. And of course, now if we look at the head to head between these two, they have actually met this year and four goals were recorded. And of course, T, they have good ratings, and of course, the standing position is still good. We are still expecting an over 1.5 goal here as one of the best choice, as well as an over 2.5 goal is the next possibility to occur in this game. The next match in our list is actually in the Wales Kumru Premier. That's Premier League, the Wales Kumru. And of course, it's a match between Flint's Town playing versus TN TS, that's the new Sen, TNS. And of course, TNS has a very high offensive rate and more performance. And of course, now if we look at the standings, you can see TNS actually is the best in its table here. 15 matches played, 13 wins. 52 goals scored and 5 conceived. They are very offensive if you look at the performance rate based on league table as compared to the opponent who is actually at home who have played 16 matches, only 4 wins, 16 goals scored and up to 24 conceived. That's why TNS is going to take that home chance, that away chance and being so offensive is going to take that leading chance. And now if you look at the performance rate of Flint, they are not as good as compared to TNS. Now if you look at the head-to-head -head between these two, you are going to see that they have actually met three times this year and all of the times TNS has always lead and most of the times more goals were recorded like eight goals and seven goals so we still expect an over 1.5 goal here as a possibility as well as an over 2.5 or you can as well go for this new sense to take the lead in this game the next match in our list is actually in the ways Kumru South but this time is between uh, is between Abegevini Town playing versus Barry Town and of course Barry Town has more offense you can go for a shifty chance for Barry Town and you can give it as well as 2NB as the best choice. That's the away team to win. That's 2NB, bet no draw. So you can take that. And of course, if you look at the standing, Barry is the best here. 14 matches played with 12 wins. 35 goals has been scored and 13 conceived as compared to the opponent who has played 15 with 3 wins, 19 goals scored and 40 conceived. If you look at the performance rate of of Abe Gaveni, they are not they are very poor as compared to Barry. Now, if we now check the head to head between these two, you can see that they have actually met this year. Barry actually lead and seven goals were recorded. This time, Barry is actually going away, and of course, though it's going away, you can still have a high possibility chance of scoring as far as its opponent want to put goals as well. So, the best choice here is an over to go for like an over 1.5 goal as one of the best choice as far as an over 2.5 goal as the next choice to occur in this match. The next game in our list is actually in the Women Champions League women. It's a match between Benfica playing... Um, ben, I think this one is uh, this one is uh, actually going on today already. I think not that one... Okay, this is it. It's a match between Roma playing versus St. Poulton. I think we have already seen this, that we actually go for Roma to win or an over 1.5 goal as next choice, as far as an over 2.5. So you can as well check our handpick 2 plus odd from the website link below this video description. So do not forget to like, comment and subscribe and enable the notification bell icon so as to be the very first to receive new post notifications and updates and see you again in our next episode. Bye bye.